no stopping us. Hey guys, what's up? Jack here again to orient your fitness in the right direction. And I recently had a subscriber ask me an interesting question, and it was in regards to him getting pain at the bottom of his foot in his tendons, he said he felt like whenever he does calf raises, and perhaps this is something a lot of you guys experience, and I thought I'd give my input. Of course, I can give no guarantees over the internet that this is what's going on exactly, but it could very well be. So what I think is going on when he's doing the calf raises, he says he gets pain in what feels like the tendons at the bottom of his foot right here. I think, and by the way, if anyone's gonna troll me about wearing glasses, indoors, whatever, I don't care. I've had this done with me before. In fact, like a video down below where it was very good, but I got many thumbs down because I was wearing sunglasses and I had no abs. I'll leave it in the description below. But anyways, back to the topic, back to the topic. So, when you have pain at the bottom of your foot when doing calf raises, you have fascia here, or connective tissue at the bottom of your foot called the plantar fascia. And essentially the plantar fascia, it's thick connective tissue, it goes from your heel bone, and it connects to your metatarsal heads over here. So it connects to your metatarsal heads up here. And so with this, this fascia, it's important in walking, running, getting that spring whenever you're moving, but it can get very stiff. And I've had personal experience with this from foot surgery, it can get very stiff. And then you can get pain in the heel of your foot when you wake up in the morning. You can get pain when you raise your foot up towards you because fascia, it does not stretch. Your plantar fascia, it does not stretch. You can massage it, but it won't stretch. It can get pulled upon though. So when you lift your foot up, it can get pulled upon and then it can become inflamed over time. Like if you're standing a lot, if you're very active, if you have very tight calves, it can inflame it. Itis means inflammation. So plantar fasciitis means inflammation of this plantar fascia. So what I think is going on is when he's doing the calf raise, he, he, I'm assuming he's standing. So if he's standing, he has the whole body, his whole body weight on his feet. He has additional weight on him, so perhaps it's on his shoulders. And also he's bringing his foot up towards him when doing the calf raise. So that's a lot of stress on your plantar fascia. So I think this could be perhaps early stage plantar fasciitis that's going on with him. It could very well be. And it feels like tendon pain because it, it goes up all the way up your foot pretty much. So I think that could be what's going on with him. And even if he's sitting, that's still a lot of weight in your feet with all that calf raise, with all that weight and you're bringing your foot up towards you, it's, it's gonna cause issues. So what I recommend is stop doing the calf raises if they're painful, stop doing them. And for at least a while until you get this resolved, you can ice at the bottom of your foot for say 15 minutes at a time. You could also massage it, so go into it with your thumbs or get some kind of massage tool, so go into it, massage it. That could help you. And stretching your calves is definitely gonna help. You have two calf muscles, gastrocnemius and soleus. To stretch your gastrocnemius, lean into a wall, knee straight, go in. Lean into that wall, 15, say 30 second holds, three times on each side. To stretch your soleus, same thing, lean into the wall, except bend your knee this time. Lean forward, 30 seconds, three times each side. So that's gonna help you if you have very flat feet, that's gonna put stress on your plantar fascia, so you could think about getting custom-made orthotics. I have them, they help a lot. Um, so doing all that could help you. It, it might not be, this is, might not be what's going on with you exactly, but it could be. If it still isn't and it's still bothering you, you go see someone. But anyways, I think this will help you. Thumb it up, comment, subscribe, do all those things. If you have any more questions, ask me. And this has been Jeff Once More. Until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>